All right, making this little video for my friend Samuel Morozov. Uh, this is my current mouthpiece collection. I have more at my house. This is just at my girlfriend's house. Uh, All Star, which was a Pan American Con brand. These were badged as step up or student mouthpieces, but really they were really, really nice. Uh, this is my All Star trumpet mouthpiece. It's got this cute little All Star emblem. I think, I don't know what those two little dots are, honestly. But it says All Star, it just says Trumpet. Um, I'd say that ID is probably about a 645, maybe a 640. It's, I call it medium. It's not tiny, but it's not very big either. The rim has a bit of bite, a bit of bite on the rim, on the inner rim. The outer rim is really, really nice. The inner rim. In my opinion, it could do to be a little less sharp than it is, but I can still play on this huge throat, like massive. We're talking like, I don't know, maybe a a 19 or an 18 or it's big. It's really big. The, the back bore, medium, not, not a huge back bore, honestly. Uh, the cup is a deep U shape. The sides, it gives, it pretty much just, you just fall into the cup until there's finally a bit of relief at the bottom. But deep cup. Uh, as deep as a Bach B, but more of a C cup shape, so I call it a U cup. Um, you can see some tooling marks on the inside of the backboard. It's not exactly clean. But that's my all-star trumpet mouthpiece. It gaps really well in most of my horns. It's maybe just a tiny bit thicker in the shank than like your standard Bach all-star trumpet big throat not good for playing above high C not at all um, doesn't speed up the air pretty much at all uh, if you just wanted to play in the staff with kind of a fluffy dark rich sound uh, it's a great mouthpiece but old school I like the blank too very very classic looking